everybody, uh, this is Angelina M. Lopez. Uh, I'm assuming that if you're here live with me, it's because you already know me. I'm a romance author. Uh, I write sexy contemporary stories about strong women and the men fortunate to love them. Um, I have here the um, boxes of Serving Sin. Uh, Thanks everybody who's joining in. I don't do lives very often, so this is a little like, what do I do with my hands? But um, I finally, finally, after much long waiting, got my copies, author copies of Serving Sin through no fault of Harlequin or Korean Press. UPS lost my books. So somebody out there is gonna get 40 beautiful copies of Serving Sin, but somebody lost my books and, uh, but they are now here, a new box of books. And I figured uh, since Instagram is such a lovely and supportive romance community that I would share the opening of the boxes with you. I actually started cutting them at open. I started cutting the boxes open and then I was like, wait a second. Um, this is a big deal because I talked about this in a blog already. This is the final book in my debut series. Hi, Jackie. Hi, everybody. Thanks for joining in. Um, this is the final book in my debut series. I have been a writer my whole life, but always wanted to be a fiction writer. Instead, I went into journalism. I did other things along the way and um, wanted to be a romance writer for about 20 years. And this series, with the end of it, I'm gonna have three books in the world, which is just this like kind of crazy, phenomenal, miraculous thing. The series started with Lush Money, then Hate Crush, and now Serving Sin. And uh, it feels really important to commemorate these kind of milestones because writing is hard and publishing is hard. And it's great too, and it's wonderful, and it's hard. It's all of those things in a row. And my husband is an incredible proponent of celebrating the wins. And so with this book being out or being done and about to be out and about to hold my hand, um, I really wanted to commemorate it and share it with all of you. And I cry easily, so there's all this that. <laughs> but anyway, um, it's already cut open because again, I realized I needed to do this live. But let me show you uh, the beautiful books that are Serving Sin. <laughs> I brought uh, supportive things. I brought my Jensen Ackles pictures to help me out and my parents' bottle of wine, which uh, I'm sorry here, you can't see it. Well, you still can't see it anyway. Um, my parents' vineyard is what inspired this whole crazy bonkers series. Um, and then my supernatural signed copy of Lush Money, that's Jensen Ackles' signature right there, because I'm officially crazy. So anyway, I brought supportive things to keep me from crying too much while I open this. Um, here you go. <laughs> uh, paperback copies of Serving Sin. Um, they did a little bit kind of like nice little blingy bling. You can't really see it here, but on the back and the cover is beautiful. It's really interesting. Um, the other covers are a lot more kind of um, grandiose and this is much more domestic. Um, there is this beautiful sh chandelier in the background, but I really like this was is a little bit of a quieter story, um, even though it's equally as bonkers, but it's a lot more interior. It's a lot more slow burn. Um, it's a lot more about two people who are yearning and healing. And I think they did a great job of representing kind of the feeling and the intimacy of this book that's a little bit less um, caustic <laughs> than the other two books. Um, so yeah, uh, here it is, Serving Sin. And I'll show you with, it's neat to see it with the other one. So, there's Lush Money, the original cover of Lush Money. I wanna show you in Mass Market first. And then Hate Crush, and then Serving Sin. So this is it. Angelina M. Lopez's first debut series, Filthy Rich Out in the World, yay! Yeah, it's a big deal, people. <laughs> it's really crazy. Hopefully there will be lots more series to come. I've already announced my next series, uh, Joyfully Mexican, hopefully comes out May 2022 is when it's, uh, when it's scheduled right now. But the first one, my first babies, um, is a big deal. Serving Sin was written last year during the depths of the pandemic. And actually on May 25th, the same day Serving Sin comes out, 
I've got an article coming out with Frolic Magazine and I'm called about pandemic babies. I talked to these amazing authors, one of them who's with us, uh, Naima Simone, um, but I talked to these amazing authors about this crazy process of writing happily ever afters in the midst of pandemic when it seemed like nothing, uh, we were never gonna get a happily ever after again. And some authors, you know, it, it actually helped them focus. It helped them, you know, they had such a great routine or they needed the focus that the pandemic and all of the things that we had to do with that helped them focus. Some authors, it was really, really, really difficult. I was somewhere in the middle, but it's this article of JC Lee, Naomi Simone, Susan Elizabeth Phillips, um, Carla Kravitil, uh, Mindy Klosky, uh, all were, all helped me kind of talk about uh, writing these pandemic books, writing Happily Ever Afters in the midst of kind of everything, feeling like they were falling apart and what that looked like. So anyway, you can read about that on May 25th in the Frolic Magazine. Um, it was a crazy thing writing this book and this was hard fought for. These pandemic babies were hard fought for and worth it at the end. It's really wonderful to be able to give people the hope of Happily Ever After. Uh, in kind of the very, very worst of times. And so, uh, yeah, so let me show you all the covers when they're all the original. So this was the second uh, cover for Lush Money. They reprinted it in trade paperback with a new cover uh, that you could purchase at Walmart. And I think you can get them at other books. I'm not sure kind of where this is. Anyway, Lush Money and then uh, Hey Crush and serving sin so look how beautiful my beautiful multicultural couples are together ah uh, it kills me it kills me these books are it's really interesting because in the midst of so many illustrated covers right now i still think these stand out i still think they stand alone because of course because they're my babies and i love them but uh yeah, Karina Press just did a phenomenal job of putting them together. Um, so, Serving Sin, uh, you can get it too in audio, excuse me, ebook and mass market paperback May 25th, next Tuesday. Um, it comes out in audiobook June 15th. There was a little bit of a delay on the audiobook, and so it'll be out available then June 15th. If that's your preference, I know a lot of people prefer to listen. Uh, the audio reader is the same one who did Lush Money and Hey Crush, Scarlett Hayes. She's, she's so good, guys. She's so good. She's so talented. So even if you've read uh, any of the books, if you want to just have them reinvented, please listen to Scarlett Hayes because she does, she turns them into these plays. And the other thing, it's a female reader, but she does the guys' voices so well. She makes them so painfully sexy and it's one of those things that when i listen to her read my books i blush because it's like somebody else wrote them it's kind of an insane thing but anyway audiobook uh this is out may 25th in ebook and paperback audiobook june 15th but i've got some really fun things coming up on may 25th i've got several events online events um i'll be doing a romance by the book takeover i'll be doing uh, a Racy Reads party room on Facebook with a bunch of friends will be celebrating the release with me. Um, again, I'll be in Frolic uh, Magazine on May 25th. And then I'll be with uh, Melanie Johnson and her Meet Cutes here on IG on June 13th, I believe. I'll be with Adriana Herrera, who's also doing a live event on June 8th. And then uh, June 12th, <laughs> I will be interviewing the bodyguard to Jensen Ackles and Jared Padalecki of Supernatural fame. My hero here for Serving Sin is a bodyguard, Roman Shepherd, and my husband had the idea, I wanted to do a fun um, online bookstore event, and my husband had the idea, he said you should interview a celebrity bodyguard, and I laughed and I said I only know one, I don't know him, but I know of one, and I emailed Cliff Kosterman, the bodyguard to Jensen Ackles and Jared Padalecki of Supernatural. And he emailed back in like an hour and was like, yeah, that sounds great. <laughs> the world's nicest human, incredible man, incredible stories about this job that create, it does provide a lot of self-sacrifice or it makes for a lot of self-sacrifice. It also is these phenomenal moments and this inside into a world that few people get to see, incredible access, but it's also not easy. It's tedious, 
Sometimes it's hard and sometimes it's dangerous. So Clip's gonna talk all about that on June 12th. We're doing a live event with um, um, One More Page Books in Falls Church and um, you can pre-order or sign books from me there. Uh, I've got a bunch of events coming up and I need to get them on my events page, but there's gonna be a lot of time to celebrate this final series. And then ultimately, we're gonna get to start celebrating the new series. Uh, I announced a new series, I don't know, last week, a couple weeks ago, uh, called Joyfully Mexican. It's about three Mexican-American sisters who return to their small Kansas hometown to revive the family bar and in the process discover they actually love their hometown. So um, I am from small town Kansas. I was born in small town Kansas. My dad's whole Mexican-American family. I'm third generation American, but my dad's whole Mexican-American family is from there. And um, it's a story very near and dear to my heart. Mexicans have been here a long time. We Mexican-Americans have been here a long time. Uh, we are here and we're gonna be here. <laughs> and the United States benefits from our presence. So I'm gonna get to tell that story. And obviously I'm not excited about it at all. So anyway, but this is filthy rich for us. And um, I'll be hosting a lot of giveaways with all the release events. So a lot of opportunities to get a signed copy um, of Serving Sin and uh, party with my lovely, lovely author friends. And um, I don't know, just celebrate the crazy, crazy thing of having a series out in the world. So anyway, thank you everybody for joining me. Um, for joining me. Um, I will go before I cry anymore because that's just embarrassing. So anyway, have a wonderful, wonderful afternoon, everybody. Serving soon, May 25th. Please share with all your friends. Thanks a lot, everybody. Have a good day.